Because for some reason you can't roll the window down. I saw you roll it up. I'm gonna I don't answer questions. Question. I don't answer questions. You don't answer questions. That's correct. What's the reason for that? I don't answer questions. Hello. How are you doing? Good. Are you, do you know this lady back here in the accident? or? I don't answer questions. Okay. Well, have a nice day, sir. All right. Thank you. Can I help you? Me, sir. Are you Kenneth Suter? There is I don't answer questions. Can I help you? I was looking for a Kenneth Suter. I, I, I don't answer questions. I don't answer questions. Pronounce your last name for me. I don't answer questions. I'm going to need you to pronounce your last name. I don't answer questions. It's there on the license. Okay. Who was the gentleman you were just standing here? I don't answer questions. Is, is there a reason why? I don't answer questions. Okay. Do you have a nice day? Okay. You too. Can you give me your phone number? I don't answer questions. Okay, is there anybody here that can answer questions? Don't answer questions. Okay. I'm not sure how to respond to that, sir. Sorry. Okay. Have a nice evening. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? I bring to you the original gangster of I Don't Answer Questions. At least the original gangster of I Don't Answer Questions on YouTube. I'm sure there's been people that have came along before Mr. Kenny Suter and took the Fifth Amendment and refused to answer questions. But as far as going on YouTube and making viral videos saying I don't answer questions, this is the original gangster, the original Kenny Suter. These videos are anywhere from 8 to 11 years old on his channel. Um, his channel has been inactive for a little while, but I just kind of wanted to pay homage because I know me and a lot of the other activists that are on YouTube started out learning from this guy right here. I know I did. Anyways, let's get to the video. This is going to be a real treat for you guys who have never seen Kenny Suter. Go over and subscribe and tell him I sent you. I'll see y'all later. Yes, sir. Roll your window down for me, please. Uh, I can hear you just fine. So I'm gonna have to ask you to roll the window down. I can hear you just fine, officer. There's my license. To roll the window down, please. I can hear you just fine, officer. There's my license. There's my registration. Or my insurance. Is there some reason you can't roll the window down? I saw you roll it up. I'm gonna I don't answer answer questions. Question. I don't answer questions. You don't answer questions. That's correct. What's the reason for that? I don't answer questions. Do you want my license and registration or not? <laughs> now this cop is butthurt and he's throwing a little miniature temper tantrum, throwing the guy's registration back into his car, not handing it to him. Now watch in a minute, he's going to act like a real invalid, like a little baby. Oh, I can't put nothing through the crack and I can't grab paperwork through the crack unless you roll it down all the way. I mean, it is literally disgusting how this officer is going to act because Kenny won't roll his window down all the way and obey him. Pronounce your last name for me. I don't answer questions. I'm going to need you to pronounce your last name. I don't answer questions. It's there on the license.
Actually, I think it said 40. Actually, I'm pretty sure it's 30. You're pretty sure or you're positive? You're pretty sure or you're positive? I can argue with you. All right, well, I'll just turn around and I'll check. Here's your information. You want to hand it to me, please? Um, that's as far as I'm Would going. you please stick it through the window? I'm not going to do that, Mr. Stewart. All right, well, then, I don't know what to tell you. Sounds like we're going to be on the side of the road a long time. Well, I guess so. This officer's ego will not allow him to hand Mr. Souter back his paperwork. You can see there's a clear two-inch crack. I mean, he could fit a whole notebook through that crack if he wanted to. But his ego won't allow him because he doesn't know how to take it that Kenny is not obeying him and licking his boots like most other people do after this officer steals their money. Right through here. Thank you. That's not going to work. Uh, yeah, it is. Okay. Well, I don't know what to tell you. I'm willing to take it right here. Would you please give this to me, or are you not going to give me the ticket? No. Officer, am I being detained or am I free to go? I am being detained? Am I being detained? He won't answer me. Mr. Suter, here's your copy. Thank you. Court date is June 6th, June 7th at 2 o'clock. Thank you. Am I free to go now? Am I free to go? I'm not being detained any longer? Nope. All right, thank you. Are we okay? Am I free to go? Roll up your windows, brother. Yes, sir. Or yes, ma'am. You really went down so I can talk to you for a second? That's all right. Thank you. Do you have a driver's license and insurance? Yeah. Are you from the area? Yeah. You are? The people of the preferred family said that you drove them a lot of free time. They didn't know if you were lost or what. Are you lost? I don't answer questions. Alright sir, give me information back. 
Is it against the law to drive through the parking lot? Absolutely not. Then what was your probable cause for pulling me over? I stopped you. I'm here investigating a missing juvenile, and they said that you have drove through the lot three times. People drive around when they're getting ready to pick up a juvenile from there, so I was just making sure you weren't related to him. Was that against the law, what I did? No. Then what was your probable cause for pulling me over? I was investigating a cir suspicious circumstances at that address. Don't you need a probable cause, traffic violation, or an infraction of the law for you to pull me over? I have probable cause. What was that probable cause? Because you were investigating a juvenile? No, I don't want to get out of the car. I hear you through your window. Yes, you can. You've been having a I conversation. Can hear you. You've been having a conversation with me thus far. I can barely hear you. All right, I don't appreciate being pulled over for nothing. All right. For what? I don't appreciate being pulled over for nothing. I pulled you over for an investigation. You have to have probable cause. What I you? Do. That was not probable cause. I do. Have a nice evening. You do. Exactly, and that's what it takes. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I don't answer questions. Is there a reason why? I don't answer questions. Okay. Do you have a nice day? Okay. You too. Hello. How are you doing? Good. Are you, do you know this lady back here in the accident? or? I don't answer questions. Okay. Well, have a nice day, sir. All right. Thank you. How's it going? I help you? Don't make me sir. Are you Ken the suitor? I don't answer questions. Can I help you? I was looking for a Ken the suitor. I, I I don't answer questions. Okay. Can you give me your phone number? I don't answer questions. Okay. Is there anybody here that can answer questions? Don't answer questions. I'm not sure how to respond to that, sir.